Good morning, GMS. I'm Izzy. And I'm Emma. And welcome to the GMS News Show for the week of March 7th. If you are interested in playing softball, there will be a softball workout clinic today and Wednesday from 6 to 8 p.m. in the GMS Auxiliary Gym. Please keep in mind that students with two or more Fs on the semester period cannot participate in or attend extracurricular activities at GMS. Yearbook prices have increased to $40 so far this year. Get yourself one at yearbookforever.com. There's also a link on the GMS homepage. If you haven't purchased a yearbook yet, what are you waiting for? Track season starts today after school in the auxiliary gym. You need to have an athletic physical on file in the athletic office and, you, and have your contact information completed on final forms to participate. Track team is open to all 6th, 7th, and 8th boys and girls at GMS who do not have two or more Fs. See you after school. Now let's go to the special interview of the week, top trending in the GMS sports update. Have a great week, everybody, and remember to stay safe. Welcome to the Top Trending of the Week, where we share the weirdest and funniest stories. I'm Amaya, and let's get started with number two. Did you know that in Japan, sumo wrestlers make babies cry for good luck? This is a tradition that has been going on for about 400 years now. They say if a sumo wrestler can make your baby cry, then your baby will live a healthy life. They say they have a special ceremony where their parents hand their babies over to the sumo wrestlers, who then bounce the baby up and down, and sometimes even roar in the baby's face. Number one. According to the News for Kids, Russia has launched a full invasion of Ukraine. The attack began early on Thursday, February 24th, as Russian President Vladimir Putin announced a special military operation. The US and NATO countries have condemned the attack and promised to increase sanctions on Russia. Mr. Putin announced the attack early, early Thursday. He said that his goal was to take away Ukraine's military, military abilities. At least 10 different areas in Ukraine came under attack almost right away. Russia so Russian soldiers with military equipment began attacking the country from the north, east, and south. We will keep an eye on this developing story. Have a great week, GMS. Welcome to the GMS News Show Interview of the Week. I'm Lillian here with the GMS Divers. What are your names and what grades are you guys in? I'm, I'm Lucy Galbraith and I'm in sixth grade. I'm Shaylin Roberts and I'm in sixth grade. I'm Haley Vicio and I'm in eighth grade. I'm Aubrey Waymeyer and I'm in sixth grade. Aubrey, would you like to start by telling us how you started diving? I started diving when I was eight. I was a swimmer first, and then I saw the divers diving, and the coach invited me over, and then that's just when I started diving. Shaylin, what about you? Um, mostly Aubrey, but I just wanted to try something new. <laughs> Haley, tell us about the worst smack or failed dive you've ever done. Okay, so last week on Friday, I went to practice in a great mood, right? And then... Um, on my last dive of the night, I did a back somersault with a half twist, and I didn't go out a lot, so I basically just scraped my whole entire back on the board, and I still have the scar on my back. So. Lucy, um, tell us about your worst smack or fail dive you've ever done. Um, I was trying to do a back fall in, and my coach was supposed to grab my feet and flip me back, but I chickened out and I hit my whole back. Aubrey, what dive are you working on right now? Right now I'm working on my, um, like, my one and a half. It's one somersault and then you dive in with it, so it's like one and a half somersaults, I guess. Haley, what about you? I'm working on two dives right now. So one of them's a reverse one and a half and one of them's a front double. Lucy, what's your favorite dive? Probably a front standing dive. Shaylin, what about you? Um, front twister. For all of you, we'll start with Aubrey. What dive took you the longest to master? The dive that took me the longest to master was probably just my back dive. Mine was any front twister. Also the front twister. Mine was the standing front dive. Thank you so much, all of you, for coming on our show today. Have a great week. Hi, welcome to GMS Sports. I'm Carson. At Monday, March 7, 2022, 7th grade girls basketball at 5.30 at 1st Round County. And then 8th grade girls basketball versus Franklin at 7 o'clock p.m. at home. Girls 7th grade basketball on March 8th, 2022 at 2nd Round County away starting at 5.30 p.m. Then it's on March 10th, 7th and 8th grade girls basketball 
th the county finals starting at 5.30 p.m. at home, and then the middle school wrestling tournament at 5 o'clock p.m. at Beach Grove. Then on March 12th, wrestling mid-states tournament away at 9 o'clock a.m. And so long for GMS Sports.